Hello everyone. So today in this video, I'm going to explain how to give ankle block With indications, anatomy, landmark, and the technique. So indication, it can be used as surgical anesthesia or post-operative analgesia. For surgeries on foot. Foot is innervated by five nerves, two deep and three superficial nerves. And all these nerves are the branches of sciatic nerve except saphenous. All of these provide sensory innervation. While two deep nerves also provide motor supply to foot. Superficial perineal nerve supplies the dorsum of the foot except the first web space which is supplied by the deep perineal nerve. Sole of foot is supplied by the posterior tibial nerve with saphenous and sural nerve providing sensation to the middle and lateral side of foot respectively. So for ankle block we have to give 5 injection 1 in the midline in front and 2 in front of malleolus and 2 behind the malleolus. Deep perineal nerve lies between the two tendon external hollicis longus and external digitorum longus tendon just lateral to the artery which can be used as a landmark. But if the artery is not palpable, ask the patient to dorsiflex the foot so the tendons get prominent. Then insert the needle perpendicular to the skin in between these two tendons until you hit the bone. Then withdraw the needle 1 to 2 mm and deposit 3 to 5 ml of local anesthetic. Now posterior tibial nerve runs posterior to posterior tibial artery that is in between medial malleolus and the Achilles tendon. Insert the needle at 60 degree to the skin posterior to the artery which is in between the malleolus and the tendon 1 cm depth and 1 cm superior to this point and 5 ml of local anesthetic is injected. Saphenous nerve runs alongside the saphenous vein in, in between the medial malleolus and the anterior tibial tendon. Insert the needle in between these two landmarks and make a subcutaneous wheel of 2 to 5 ml of local anesthetic. Sural nerve is located in between lateral malleolus and the Achilles tendon and is blocked by injecting 3 to 5 ml of local anesthetic subcutaneously in a feed like distribution between Achilles tendon and the lateral malleolus. Superficial perineal runs subcutaneously on the anterior lateral side of the ankle just lateral to the extensor digitorum longus tendon. Insert the needle over the lateral malleolus and tunnel the needle subcutaneously towards the extensor digitorum longus tendon and give 5 to 7 ml of local anesthetic between these two points in a band like pattern. And as you can see, the entry point for deep perineal nerve block can also be used. And now some tips. Out of 5 nerves, which starts with S, superficial perineal, sural, and the saphenous are the sensory only. Although it is a volume block but a lower concentration of local anesthetic can also be utilized because motor blockage is often not needed. Deep perineal, superficial perineal and the saphenous nerve can be blocked through a single entry point. So that's all. Please like, share and subscribe my channel for more videos.